It's just a box with books. You don't need a library card. There aren't fines for returning a book late. And the rules are pretty simple. You just take a book and return a book. Just stop by this little free library, grab a book or two, and take them home. When you're done reading them, bring them back. And you are always welcome to contribute books to the library as well. Robin and her family built this library last year when they moved to Blaine. They were used to having several around them when they lived in St. Paul, but noticed there were fewer in the suburbs. So they built one. Once you get it up and going, it kind of takes care of itself. And um, in the long run, I think, it's, I think it's worth a little bit of the labor and the, and the cost of it. She has become a casual librarian on her days off, checking on her little free library and making sure it is clean and well stocked. But her day job? Anoka County librarian. For me, working at a library, it's not really a job. It's just, I, I enjoy being like just surrounded by books and people who appreciate a good book. Robin keeps her library full by taking books that are going out of circulation at the library. She also buys books at thrift stores and uses books from her own collection to keep it well stocked. I had a couple of books um, that I really loved and I was, it was hard because I didn't really want to give them away because they were like my favorite favorite books, but I thought, you know, I just kind of want to share um, how good they are. And I just, you know, I had a couple that I put in there and, and they've been checked out. I don't know if they'll come back, but that's all right because they're good books and I, you know, I don't mind sharing them. This library has popular children's books as well as novels and books for teens. Sometimes a unique book will pop up and immediately disappear. A Justin Bieber autobiography and I think that one lasted about a day and I haven't seen it come back, so um, I'm not sure if we're going to get that one back. On this day, to her surprise, one of her favorite books has come back. I think I'll leave it in there for somebody else to enjoy. Yeah. Never knowing what might show up is one of the exciting parts of using the Little Free Library. But Robin's favorite part? This is open 24 hours and 365 days a year, which is kind of a cool thing because at the library, it's not open every day. So, um, but this kind of runs itself. And so it's kind of kind of cool that I don't have to, to be out here at 6 a.m. when somebody jogs by and wants a book. For North Metro TV News, Danica Peterson, reporting.